hello all welcome to mix study official youtube channel in this video we are going to see about the new recruitment that is sjvn uh, for the apprentice training and these are the official information which i have received from the official website so this is the mini retina company which is come under the public sector unit of government of india they regularly release the notification related to the recruitment now they have released the notification for the apprenticeship trainee for the different post so for the mechanical they have released the 40 number of seats for the bachelor degree for the graduate apprenticeship similarly for the diploma and other uh, apprenticeship program they have also there so for the degree uh, they have mentioned that the total number of posts was 40 and you need to have a bachelor degree in engineering or technology in the relevant branch which they have mentioned over here similarly for the electrical as well as civil architecture instrumentation and other branches as well they have mentioned over here and if you belonging to any of the branches you can uh, check the detailed notification over here so going ahead with the diploma they have also released a diploma apprenticeship program for the mechanical they are total 24 posts in that you will require a full-time diploma in engineering and technology in the relevant branch which is related which they have mentioned over there like mechanical electrical civil architecture information technology and based on it they have also mentioned the number of posts which will available for the respective branches so similarly going ahead with the most important point which they have mentioned over here that is age limit the minimum age of 18 year and maximum age will be 30 years as per the date of closing of advertisement and for the SCST they have five years of relaxation similarly for the three years for the OBC having NL NCL like non-criminal layer certificate and for the 10 years for the PWDS a stipend will be offered for the graduate apprenticeship for the 10,000 per month similarly for the diploma having 8,000 per month and this program is available only for the one year there is no extension for the apprenticeship program of any of the graduate apprentice or either of diploma apprentice or any other program as well so again going with the reservation as per the government of apprentice acts uh, they will continue reservation for the cst obc and pwd candidate similarly they have also mentioned few other points related to the 25 percent of paf that is uh, candidate who is related to the project affects areas and they will reservation and you are not object any of the things because it's a company policy and you cannot go ahead according to the organizations so going ahead with the next point can only they have mentioned that the important point only candidate who are domicile of himanchal pradesh are eligible to apply those who are related to any other state they are not eligible to apply for these posts and even though they have already done any of the candidate who is already completed the apprentice program or any have experience in any of the organization they are not eligible to apply for this post and they have also mentioned that there is no extension of training of an employment given for the after completion of this training like there is no permanent job in the organization once you completed these things and they have also like mentioned that the for the selection criteria the selection process based on only for the merit which is based on in 10th and 12th standard along with that your bachelor degree of engineering and respective courses like mba which is required in your respective apprentice program so similarly they have mentioned over there you can also inform through official website if you have shortlisted before that you need to register for that and they, once you uh, you will shortlist it you will get the on official website to register and they have mentioned the procedure over there if you uh, shortlist it, definitely go through go through the procedure how you can apply i hope these video are uh, informative and helpful for those who, those who are related to the uh, living in a Himanchal Pradesh because uh, I do not aware of that like these posts are applicable for the Himanchal Pradesh So don't worry if you related to any other apprentice program if you need any other apprentice program If any of the thing is coming in a few days I'll definitely inform to those candidate who is related to other part of India as well So I hope this video are informative if you think then do a like and share with your friends and subscribe this channel. Thanks for watching